this is the video for mean, median, mode, and range. These terms are defined in the back of your child's journal or the student's journal. If they are not there, they need to copy them the next time they are in class. So for this video, this is the set of data that we're going to be working with. 8210234. If you need to pause the video to write those down, please do so at this time. For the mean, what you need to do is, is add up all the numbers. So 8 plus 2 plus 1 plus 0 plus 2 plus 4 plus 3 plus 4 is 24. You probably want to make sure that you have all the numbers, so I counted all of them up. There's eight numbers here, eight numbers up there, so I made sure I had all of them. That's where I got 24. Now the next step is to take this sum of 24, and I'm going to divide it by how many numbers were in my sequence. There was a total of eight numbers in the sequence. Zero still counts. It's one of the numbers in the sequence. So I divide eight or 24 by eight to get three. So my mean for this set of data is 3. To figure out the median, you need to order all the numbers from lowest to highest. If a number occurs twice, write it twice. Do not skip a number or leave a number out. But once you have them in order from lowest to highest, you need to figure out which one is in the middle. To do that, you just slowly work yourself in towards the middle. And when we find out in this one is that there is one, no there's not, there's two numbers in the middle. This two and three share the middle. So when the middle is shared by two numbers, you add the numbers together. So we have two plus three equals five. Now you have to divide that by two. So five divided by two is 2.5. So your median is 2.5 for this set of data. The mode is the number that occurs most often. It has to occur more than one time, and it also has to occur the most. Sometimes there may be more than one mode. Like in this set of data, the easiest way to see it is when you have your number set up for your median, you can see real easily that the 2 occurs twice and the 4 occurs twice. They both occur more than one time, and they both occur the most amount of times. But if there was another number that occurred three times, that number would be the mode. So for this set of data, because these two numbers occur twice, the mode is both two and four. For the range, you take the highest number, which was eight, subtract the lowest number, which was zero. Gives you eight, so your range for this set of data is 8.